and welcome to FIFA Save My Life. Thank you very much for joining me today on this morning. We have a morning uh, show. Uh, yes, we do. It is a 11 o'clock. We knew it was coming. We were excited. We were on uh, the edge of our seats. It is, of course, the Premier League uh, Player of the Month. Last month, we had Trent Alexander-Arnold, England International, right back. At the month before, we had uh, Mo Salah at, uh, obviously, Egyptian International, doing bits over there in the old African Cup. And uh, Liverpool legend, as it is. Uh, and, uh, yeah, I can't, I can't remember the month before. Uh, it was someone. Uh, but uh, this month... This month, we have Raheem the Dream. Uh, yes, we have Raheem Sterling. I actually voted for Martinelli, to be fair, uh, due to the fact that I thought he had a really good uh, month. Uh, three goals, few assists. But I was wrong. Uh, it turns out that uh, Raheem Sterling was better. So that's who won it. Uh, that is who has uh, that uh, the people's vote. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna go in there. We're gonna have a do a player review. We're gonna have a look at him, uh, see how sexy he is, but also how much money he may be. That is pretty much the brass tax of the whole situation. How much money is he? Uh, and also, what position is he? Uh, that is also uh, the other side of it. So guys, before we do any of that, make sure you hit like, make sure you hit subscribe. It would mean a lot to me, but also uh, I give some money to charity. I give money to OTR. OTR are a mental health charity that looks after 11 to 25 year olds. At uh, They're called Off The Record. They do brilliant work. And this uh, FIFA, I would like to be supporting them. And it doesn't cost you anything. Uh, literally, you have to hit a like, hit a subscribe, watch a video of 10. And yeah, basically, that gets to give me money uh, that gives me money to give to them. Uh, so yeah, that's all you got to do, my friends, is for free, hit that like, hit that subscribe. You should have done it already. Uh, it takes a millisecond. So there you go, guys. Uh, right, let's have a look at uh, Raheem the Dream Sterling. Uh, really good in the Euros. Uh, an amazing player, one of my favourite players, even though people slag him off uh, on a regular basis, which I don't understand. He plays probably the best club in the country. Uh, he plays really well for that best club in the country. I don't get where he gets uh, pelters from people. Uh, and he always, always turns up for England. Always. Uh, so, yeah, let's have a look at him. Uh, so we've got the normal suspects. And there he is, wearing his hat backwards. He is a left winger, my friends. And he's only three to complete. Now, this could be, like, stupidly, an 88, an 89, and a 90. Uh, I don't know. But three is promising. It's promising. Uh, so, yes, uh, we're going to have a look. Are we ready? <sighs> I could do this. Uh, though I do have, obviously, my man uh, Neymar there. He could be a great sub. Uh, what are we looking at? 85, okay. With team of the week. Uh, 86, not team of the week. And 87, player of the week. Uh, that's not too bad. I'm saying that is probably in the region of a, I don't know, 250, maybe 300,000. Yeah, 250 I'm going to go for. I might be undershoot. Yesterday, I undershot a lot, uh, by the way. Uh, I can't remember which one it was. I did last night. Uh, whichever player came out last night. Which player did come out last night? I'm going to... Pato. Uh, I massively undershot his valuation. So, normally I'm quite spot on. Uh, but uh, today I could be closer than yesterday. But I'm going to say, yeah, around the 300 mark, maybe a little bit more. Uh, but looks good. Uh, looks good. What you get in return as well? You get a small gold rare, you get a rare electron, and you get a mega, mega pack. Uh, so that's actually not too bad. Uh, yeah, the mega pack anyway. Uh, right, let's have a look at Raheem the Dream Sterling. Uh, we have, he's obviously five foot seven. He's got high medium, that's perfect. He's got four star skill moves. He's got that pain in the ass three star weak foot though. Uh, and especially if he's on the left hand side, that, that can be problematic, especially when it comes to first time shots. Uh, but uh, let's ignore that and carry on. Uh, we have a 95 pace. That is a, a massive plus right there. At uh, 99 acceleration, 92 sprint speed. He is going to feel, with his little T-Rex hands, T-Rex hands, uh, he is going to feel a radic. Uh, he is going to be really fast. Uh, he is going to be really good. He's got that amazing uh, sort of animation body shape. Uh, that makes him feel even faster than he really is. At, uh, yeah, I really like that. 99, 92. 
Uh, he's looking attractive already. Got 95 attack position. Uh, he is a great attack. Could be a great forward for you if you wanted him to be, to be honest. Uh, uh, probably where I'd put him is left forward. Uh, he is 89 finishing. Absolutely brilliant. Mo better than most strikers, to be fair. Uh, 82 shot power, 87 long shot. I've just spotted something I don't like, which we'll come to in a second. Uh, we've got very good passing. Uh, we've got 86 vision, 83 crossing. Mm. Uh, 87 short passing. That's adequate. That's fine. Uh, not great, but you want him up the far, uh, far end of the pitch rather than in the middle. Uh, so passing really is just a simple x pass really uh you don't want too much crossing and you don't want too much anything else you just kind of want a simple like square ball if you're going to do it if you're not going to have a shot so yeah 87 is more than good enough uh we got 86 uh, 98 agility 97 balance he along with that pace is gonna feel amazing uh, absolutely amazing we got 94 reactions a beautiful uh, we got 90 ball control a beautiful we got 91 dribbling a beautiful and here's the crux 82 composure right okay the reason that's really bad is now let's go back to the beginning three star weak foot now the three star weak foot means at the amount of times that you get that ball across and you just know that if you hit it first time it is going to be a beautiful top of top bin shot from the left uh, or from the right and it just goes across nicely and the goalkeeper's animation has absolutely no chance uh no chance whatsoever of uh getting on to the end of that ball uh the three star weak foot means that could miss more often than shoot and then composure 82 could also mean that it misses more than it hits the target uh, that is your bummer uh, that is your bummer on this uh, he's defending yeah we're going to move on uh, his stamina is 85 so yeah he should just about last all game his strength and his aggression is poor because he's going to get knocked off the ball so yeah uh, there's a couple of bad things about it uh, which is probably reflected in the price uh again we saw a 91 92 or whatever it was uh salah he was like a mill uh ridiculous uh again obviously uh other player we got uh, ronaldo obviously he's been out so far and of course he was like 1.5 or whatever it was 2 million uh so yeah there was a uh, we've had some really expensive ones this is not far off the rating and actually has some really good stuff but again he's a fraction of the price and that's the reason why my friends we got flare and speed dribbler which is expected so yeah in in oh, yeah in in synopsis uh high medium perfect four star skills more than good enough three star weak foot is gonna be problematic uh, to a certain degree not the end of the world but problematic got amazing finishing it's superb speed uh, passing is a little poo, but just good enough. Uh, the crossing, see, what I would now say is with that composure and with that weak foot, you would be better off using him as a proper winger and, and getting him down the line and cross it in. But he's crossing so poor at 83 that you might struggle. So you're going to have to add something to his crossing and passing. You're going to have to. and uh, Otherwise, he ain't going to be really as good as he should be um so yeah that that's something you're definitely going to have to look at to improve this guy uh but yeah he, his dribbling is absolutely pff, mental uh it really is mental uh I, I i would really just get him for his dribbling and speed to be fair he is going to be a nuts fun uh really is his composure is poor uh his strength is poor uh his defending is poor which is fine because you don't want him coming back but his stamina is just good and he's got a couple of nice traits you can see why the the price is reflective uh it is not a top tier uh price uh he is a amazingly good card but i would say he has his faults and you can kind of see why he's he's kind of a little bit cheaper than probably you thought he was going to be you saw at the beginning when i said <gasps> three uh, i was excited and I still think he's cheap. Uh, I still think he's cheap. He's probably uh, t probably more expensive than I'm saying. Let's have a quick look. See if he's out yet on uh, the old foot bin. Um, let's have a look. Uh, home, Raheem Sterling. Do we have any prices? Yeah, well, okay. So I was wrong. Uh, he's 400 grand. Uh, barring pence and pounds. Uh, he is 400 grand, guys. Uh, so, yeah. It is... It's... Half a mil, just shy of half a mil. I don't know. Uh, 
for his speed, for his shooting, for his dribbling, absolutely. The little bits on top, his composure and his weak foot and his strength is going to be a minor issue, I would say. Uh, yeah, if you've got a premiership team, you got Mo on one side, you got Sterling on the other, uh, you got Ronaldo up front, you got Trent at right back. Why the hell aren't you doing it? I think it looks brilliant overall. I've tried to give you some negatives. There's very small negatives there, guys, uh, to overcome. I think the positives way out outweigh it by a long way. Uh, there you go, guys. That is my overview of the player. I think he's good. Uh, coming in at just shy of 400 grand. Uh, again, I was wrong. Shocker. Uh, uh, but a good player of the month. And a well-deserved one. Well done, Raheem Sterling. Another English one as well, to be fair. Uh, it's uh, two in, in, ten in a row with Trent and him. So the English game is in good hands. Uh, these two are leading the light uh, for the three Lions. Right, there you go, guys. Uh, I'm going to go and uh, decide that I can't do Raheem Sterling because he's too expensive. <laughs> right now. But thank you very much for watching, guys. Take care of yourself, as always. And if you can't, find someone who can. Bye-bye.